In today's session, I'm gonna show you how to configure Digicom router. First, plug in power cable on your router and connect your Ethernet from one of the LAN port to your PC. A router has two types of ports, they are LAN and WAN. Normally in Soho router, there are four types of four LANs and one WAN port. And they are in different colors, so we, we can easily find out which one is LAN port and which one is WAN. LAN ports are used for a local connection, whereas WAN is used for internet and it is always connected from the ISP side. Well, I have already made the physical connections and ready for the configurations. So let's begin the configuration right here. Uh, here is the default SSID. Default uh, SSID is DZCOM Zinc. I'm gonna configure this router. First, you go to a ROM, type command. And check it out the your default gateway IP config. This one is your IP address, and this one is your default gateway. Copy the default gateway and open any browser that you have and paste the default gateway and it will ask you username and password. And default username and password default username is admin and password is also admin. It is M I N. Now you're uh, now you're logged in. If you are configuring uh, for the first time, then go to a setup page. Click on next. Here are three options: PPoE, dynamic IP, and static. Before configuring this uh, page, you must know what type of connection do you have. If you don't know, then just you can contact to your internet provider. In my case, my ISP is providing me a dynamic connection, so I am going to select dynamic IP, click on next. Uh, this is a SSID wireless name. I'm gonna change it. IT Hub 1, channel will be same, remain same, mode, channel. And another thing is wireless security. I personally recommend you to don't open the security open. So select second one option and uh, type the password. Password must be between 8 character to uh, 63 character. Type next and finish. Yes, we have done all the configurations, basic configurations, and this is your uh, summary of your configuration. And if you have already uh, made the configurations and you would like to have any configuration on your existing configuration, then go to a wireless tab. Okay, you can change your SSID name, mode, channel, bandwidth, and your security. And also there is another uh, tab named advanced. From here you can uh, configure more advanced settings like port triggering, DMZ, URL blocking, MAC filtering, dynamic DNS, QS setup, and so on. And another, there is another tab maintenance. From here you can upgrade and download your uh, firmware and you can take a uh, back off and restore the configuration and also uh, from uh, password option uh, menu you can change your username and password of the router and you, uh, you can set the time and date and another uh, type is status where you can see the summary configuration after you made all the configuration you can go and check the SSID data hub IT Hub 1, this one is my router. I'm gonna connect with this SSID. My password is my Just like this, you can configure your Digicom router. Not only Digicom router, like same way we can uh, configure 
other other routers too like uh, Tenda, Dizicom, uh, TP-Link and so on. Thank you so much for watching this video.